team of the season is right around the corner and you guys need to do this now. If you're looking to buy any ultimate team coins, make sure to check out my brand new sponsor, MuleFactory.com. They're literally the cheapest place to buy coins on the internet. You'll have a five minute delivery time, 24 seven support, and also make sure to use my discount code, IHAS5 for a 5% off. What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video and we have a load of team of the season stuff. Literally two weeks or maybe even one week we could be seeing team of the season and you guys need to check out the stuff in this video. So the first thing I'm going to show you, probably one of the reasons you clicked on this video is how to get those packs very, very cheap. As you can see on the store, if you want to get yourself like a jumbo premium gold pack, that'll cost you 15,000 coins. In this example, I'm going to be showing you how to get 45k packs, those prime gold players pack for basically 9,000 coins. I'm gonna show you two examples right now of some SBCs you can do right now for 9,000 coins each. And they give you a prime gold players pack, which is a 45K pack where you get all gold players and a load of rares. So the first one here, you need to head over to the advanced section. I've got it pinned and then playing abroad. And then you need to complete the Germany squad. So doing all of these SBCs before team of the season, basically you're getting 45k packs, 50k packs, even some 100k packs before the players are out in team of the season. So you don't need to head and buy FIFA points or buy coins or spend coins on packs. You can just open the packs you have stocked up and pack those team of the season players. So I'm going to show you how to do two squads where you can get 45k pack. First one here is this Germany squad. So in goal we have Zealand. I'm just going to skip through the squad. You guys can like look down the players, pause the video if you need to, to see how much those cards are. But these squads cost literally 8,000 coins a piece, maybe 9k after this video, but they're less than 10,000 coins for a 45k pack. So these are 100% worth doing. And you get 1,000 coins back. But what you need to do is once you get the packs, do not open them yet. So that's the first one on playing the broad is that Germany squad. The other one, you need to head over to the league challenges. Go Calcio A. Head all the way down to Milan. And for doing this Milan challenge, again, prime gold players pack. This one, all Milan players, not really too hard here. We have like the likes of Zapata, we have Gomez, we have Antonelli, Kuka. And again, all of these players are costing less than 1,000 coins each here. A little bit more, but that is basically the whole squad. We actually do have a left back in left wing, but it just makes the team a little bit cheaper. Both of those squads, 45k packs if you complete them. If you have already, say if you have a second account, this is my second account. I'm completing those on. And also... If you want me to show you a video on how to do all of these, I can literally show you guys how to get 500,000 coins worth of packs for about 150k. If you want to see that video, drop a like on this one. Can we shoot for near 1,000 likes on this video? And I will be bringing that to you guys very, very soon. So again, that tip, do as many SPCs as you can. And those two you can copy in my video. But if you guys did not know, I'm going to head a link in the description down below over to Fatbin. So as you can see on the screen, just you head over to the moment page, you go under the SBC section, and it shows you every single scoreboard challenge that is on FIFA, every single one. Once you click on it, it actually shows you people who have created completed squads to actually complete those challenges, and you can order them in price, so you can make sure you're doing that SBC for as cheap as possible without either having to buy your players or watch an outdated YouTube video. The next thing, when will team of the season come out? So I did a video sort of on this a couple weeks ago, but now we have a better idea. We knew it was going to be in May, but what day? If you actually have a look at the scoreboard challenge now, we have these team of the group stage ones, which actually do expire exactly at this time tomorrow. So those are going to be gone in a day. But here, the live challenges. If we have a look at the player of the year one, we have the player of the year Ali and the player of the year Kante, which both have 15 days left. So they end two weeks tomorrow on the Friday. This could mean one of two things. Either two weeks Friday, we could be seeing something new, or we could actually be seeing the Premier League team of the season because that would sort of be the right time to end it because there's 100% going to be a team in the season card for Kante and Ali. So they'd want to end this SPC before those cards come out, if you understand what I'm talking about. So say if we see the Premier League team of the season in two weeks on Friday, that's not 100%, it's just a predicted date, but I think that's quite possible. The team of the season most consistent will actually come out a week on Friday. So that has actually already been like the draft of the players has actually already been released 100% official from EA. I'll have a picture of the squad on the screen right now. To be honest, the squad, there aren't too many players I've got my eyes on. There's like Carver Howe and Vertonghen, but to be honest, these cards, again, most consistent are cards who've played well this year but have not actually gone in for on FIFA. That's how they decide this. So that is why there isn't like the craziest amount of cards. But those cards are 100% confirmed. 
We do not have actually the stats yet, but those are the cards which will be there for Team of the Season most consistent, which hopefully we could be seeing a week tomorrow or week Friday for a date that is actually May the 5th and that time it will be 6 p.m. So another thing, I did a video, I think again a week ago, about a possibility of a Team of the Season guarantee squad build challenge. So this is predicted It'd be crazy if EA do it. It would basically be the same as these team of the tournament ones, but again, team of the season. We'd have an untradeable one, a tradable one, and then of course, like an 81 double guarantee sort of challenge. We could also see those old league guarantees. So we could have a Premier League guarantee, SPC, La League guarantee, SBC. So the requirements for these challenges, you basically need one inform card. So you, you want to be investing in inform cards once this SPC ends. So tomorrow, once those inform cards are going for discard, like, 10 11 000 coins you want to pick up some gold inform cards again instead of a team of the tournament card it would be a team of the season card and then you might just want to pick up either just some rare gold players or some 84 rated players those are usually the two different sort of requirements you could be using i would still wait for the current SBCs to end before you buy those cards but it's just a bit of a heads up if we do get some team of the season squad builder challenges in the comment section down below drop a comment on what is the best SBC pack you guys have got this year because you know these packs could go and get yourselves like a team of the season Ronaldo. That could be mad. I don't even know his rating. It'll be even 98 or 99. Crazy card that could be. Also, again, remember to smash a like on this video. 1,000 likes and I will show you all of the SPCs for the best packs you can get. You can literally get 500,000 coins worth of packs for like 150k. It's so, so easy. I'll show you all of the squads on the screen in one huge video. And we can all get geared up for team of the season and get some decent packs. On that note, thank you guys for watching. I hope you did enjoy, and I'll see you on my next video.